What if I told you there was a mode of public transit that had frequencies better than once per minute, was entirely grade separated, and was dirt cheap to build? Would you say we should build more of it? Urban gondola systems have really come into be in the past 20 years. Are these going to take off and rival other modes of transit? Well, gondolas are really good at fulfilling many of the things that people look for in a transit system. They're direct. They're frequent, often arriving every 15 seconds or better. And they're really cheap to build. Only about half the cost of the average BRT and a tenth of most rail systems. And of course, gondolas are great when you have steep terrain. So what's not to like? Well, the biggest thing is that they have terrible throughput. The cabins are slow and small, averaging about 10 to 15 miles an hour with no more than 10 to 15 people. Gondolas are also a little less accessible than other modes of transport because they really don't stop. There's also privacy issues for people on the ground, especially those that live directly under the line. So should everybody just go out and build a bunch of gondolas? I think you should only really build them if you're in a spot that has a lot of hills, only has a moderate demand of transport, has moderate distances to cover, has relatively calm weather, and then it also helps if you have bad and or difficult to build roads and rail infrastructure in place. So this isn't gonna be a great fit for most places in major cities, but there are plenty of cities and districts within cities where gondolas can be the right tool for the job. They will never replace rail or buses, but that doesn't mean that we shouldn't use them a lot more than we do now.